Hey everyone, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Make sure you smash the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. This was a highly requested video, so I hope all of you guys that requested me to make this video, you smash the like button. Alright, today we are going to be talking once again about Elise Parker because she's pulling stunts, which to me doesn't make any sense, but Let's get on with the video. Ever since Elise started her YouTube journey, she has been very, very successful. She turned her YouTube channel into a successful, thriving business. She was quote unquote writing ebooks. She made a lot of money with her Amazon affiliate links. She was selling affordable courses. She was doing a lot of sponsored videos, but they all made sense to what she was promoting at the time. For being on a plant-based diet, for living a positive life, she was thriving at the time. But sadly, over the years, money was her main concern. She was mainly focused on money. Money does corrupt people. Sadly, that's what happened to Elise. She was more focused on money, being skinny. But Elise has always been fake. That's one thing we can all agree on. Ever since the beginning, she's always been fake. Once she got paid to do Butcher Box, when she finally decided to come out and say she's not vegan anymore, that's when everything went downhill. She chose money over morals, over ethics, over everything that she preached in the past. She, because she doesn't care about you, she doesn't care about me, she doesn't care about nobody except her bank account. And she has proven that over and over and over again. She had a very successful team, but after she did that butcher box deal, that's when everything just fell apart. Carly quit. She kept going from one boyfriend to the next. She went crazy and we all saw it happen. But yet, she was blaming everyone else because she's a spoiled rich brat. So she lost a ton of subscribers, which is mainly where she would make her money when she would post her YouTube videos because people stopped watching her videos. So she was making less and less and less money from YouTube. And then she eventually stopped posting, mainly posted every once in a while, once a month. So now she created a OnlyFans account because she needed money. And she thought this was the, another income that she could make to be successful. But in my opinion, when she made the OnlyFans account, She's only showing pictures of herself in her bikinis, which don't doesn't make any sense to me because if you go back on her first ever YouTube videos, on her first ever Instagram posts, she is still selling sex. And in my opinion, that is how Elise blew up so fast because she was attracting the wrong kind of attention by selling her body, by basically posting naked pictures to get attention for herself, which was successful for her. So there's this website called fapmenu.com, Elise Parker OnlyFans leak nude photo. And if you click on it, then that's where you'll see the pictures of Elise. But if you also click on another website called 
thefappeningblog.com. That's where more of Elise's pictures are. So to me, these pictures are just the same of what she does on social media, but except now she is profiting more off of having an eating disorder. Let me know all your thoughts in the comments below. I will see you guys later.